Yeah, so 79 and Park is essentially about bringing the park, you had it, and the city of Stockholm uh, together. So we have this unique uh, location on the southwest, we're surrounded by park on two sides, to the northeast we're surrounded by city on two sides. So we sort of try to bring those two, uh, two things together. And then we've sort of uh, dissolved the perimeter block into what you could call pixels. Uh, each of them the size of a room or of a terrace. Uh, all the pixels are rotated 45 degrees, so they actually look more directly towards the, uh, the park and the open spaces. Uh, and then they're sort of stepping from uh, you know, two stories uh, in the south, uh, all the way up to uh, um, uh, the, the, the height of the, uh, of the city of Stockholm uh, uh, in the north. So you end up with this kind of pixelated uh, landscape of houses with gardens, with trees, etc. So, so when you, in the end, when you stand in Yadid and you look back uh, towards uh, the corner, you see the sort of undulating forested hills uh, suddenly continuing, but actually becoming city. Uh, on, a, on a misty day like today, you can hardly see where does the natural uh, geography and uh, and, and flora of Stockholm end, and where does the city begin? But by, um, by breaking the, the big scale of the city block down into the small scale of the rooms, uh, you get this kind of zigzag facade, which means that you're, when you're on your balcony, you actually have intimacy, you have privacy, you're not looking straight over at your, at your neighbor. Uh, and to ensure this intimacy of privacy, one facade, it feels like when you're standing in the middle of the added, looking towards the southwest corner, almost the entire building is glass. And as you move around it, it becomes 50% wood. And when you're actually standing in the northeast corner, looking back at it, it's entirely wood. <clears throat> so, so each project somehow dictates certain things that ends up becoming specific to that project. However, I think certain themes are probably overarching. But deep down, what we do try to do is that every project we do is a little bit closer to the future that we're dreaming of.